Hello everyone. Today I wanted to show you the cards that I received from my card swap. I hosted a card swap and the theme of the card swap was fall, autumn, Thanksgiving. So you could pick any one of those themes and you had to make five cards for the swap. And I received all of my cards. So what I wanted to do is I wanted to share with you the cards that I received from my swap. One of the cards that I received from my swap was from Scrappin2010, who is Lisa. And Lisa made this cute card, which is a greeting farm image. And this is a <coughs> easel card that Lisa made, which is really cute. And down here she stamped. It looks like die cut with a spellbinder die and noted on there happy um stamped on there and put happy Thanksgiving. And she also used some reds on her card, which is really cute. And then she used a button right here and a flower and a flower in the background. So this is Lisa's card, who is scrapping 2010. And if you look at her video. And subscribe to her channel. She makes really cute cards and items. You'll see her go into more detail of what she used on her card. And this is actually a dolly. It looks like she inked it. I just like distressed it. So this is from Lisa. Moving on to the next card. The next person who was in my swap is Tracy. And we know Tracy as Miss TLC1. So that's MRS TLC, the number one. And Tracy made this card, which is beautiful. Now, I contacted Tracy and asked her. I'm pretty sure that my camera does not do any justice for this ribbon. But this ribbon is beautiful. And it looks like she used some, I believe they're like flat back, the button ones. I'm not sure. Tracy didn't do a video on her card. But these are really cute. And then it looks like she used floss inside of the leaves. And then she stamped it Autumn Blessings. And I love this paper. I think this is the new stick by Die Cuts with the View. And this punch right here with the leaves is so cute. I like that. And I believe this is called a gatefold card that Tracy used. And she put the back of her information on here, on her card. So thank you so much, Tracy, for participating. And Tracy also sent me some Hostess goodies that I was not expecting at all. I believe these, and she made, this is the card that she made me. And I always call Tracy the queen of cards. She is the queen of cope coloring. If you ever check out her um, videos, Tracy always used a lot of Magnolia stamps on her cards and she can color her blending is beautiful and I believe this is a die cuts with a view lemon um flower stick I believe it's called that Joanne's was carrying I believe these are the recollection flowers probably a spellbinders die but everything just coordinates so well and then she wrote me a little note in here but I'm not going to read it but Thank you so much, Tracy. I really think this card is so cute. And she sent me this stamp set. And she also sent me this pearl pen in gold. And she sent me this book, most likely to alter. I never saw these before. And y'all know that I love to put coordinating paper on my pen. So this is perfect because it's actually like a... Um, craft card stock that's on here so it is really it is so cute I could put this in my pocketbook and it snaps and everything so I'm not sure where you got this from Tracy but this is so cute so thank you for entering my swaps and also sending some goodies that was not expected at all thank you so much and the next person who entered into my swap her name is Orletta 
And Orletta is known as Miss Ove Watson. I believe I'm pronouncing that right, but I'm going to spell it for you. M-R-S-O-V-W-A-T-S-O-N. And this is the card that she sent in. This is so pretty. Sorry, I tried to make sure that all the cards were out of their packaging and ready to go. And then here she put sending happy thoughts to brighten your day. And this butterfly is so pretty that she used. And she used a lot of bling on here. Which that's one thing I really do not have a lot of. And I love this ribbon. This is really pretty. It coordinates with the butterfly real good. So this is her card. And then the inside, she just left the inside plain. But this is her card. Thank you so much for participating. These butterflies are gorgeous. And she sent me some Hostess goodies as well that I was not expecting at all. She sent me the Make a Memories Tag Maker. And I believe I can use this with the Slice. I believe the Slice Machine has a Tag Maker cartridge that I was looking at a video the other day. So thank you so much. This can go with my Tag Maker. I mean with my Slice Machine that I just won. So thank you so much. She also sent me some other Hostess goodies. Which was a Tim Holtz Mask Flourish. I love this. This is going on a 12 by 12 layout. I never saw this one this size before, I don't think. I just had the smaller ones. And then she sent me this pack of cards. That is so cute. And this could actually be for my son, for him to send out for family members. I try to get him to participate in different things. So, he could actually put his picture in here, his school picture. Or we might take a picture and then he could just send it and put something in there. So, thank you so much. This really will come in handy for Christmas. And then she also sent me some hemp, hemp cords. And last but not least... We have Miss Angie, the Queen Bees Creations. That's Queen Bees Creations. And Angie sent me some craft goodies along with some birthday goodies. So in this video, I'm just going to show you the craft, the hostess goodies that Angie sent me. So actually what I'm going to do is I'll go to another video because YouTube only gives me 10 minutes. So I'll show Angie's car and my car as well. So thank you and please stay tuned to the next video.